Texas lawmakers could be asked to take up an issue that sexual assault advocates say could put more rapists behind bars. Experts say police need better tools and training to ask the right questions because even the smallest detail could crack a case. Susan um, was the first of the cheerleaders, myself, um, his girlfriend and his girlfriend's sister was raped. One by one, Lisa Gabbard says a rapist targeted her Castleberry High School cheerleading squad. I was awakened and looked over and saw someone in a mask. Then 18 year old Gabbard was victim three by six, the rapist turned killer, stabbing Retha Stratton to death. The man was Wesley Wayne Miller, who Gabbard says raped in four Tarrant County cities, using the same methods before he was caught. And looking back through the police reports, some of the things are similar, and we can pick those out as laymen, and so it does seem pretty unfortunate that those were not, those dots were not connected sooner. It's not uncommon. Sexual assault advocates say often it's hard to connect serial rapists to a string of crimes because of what happens after the rape. Experts say in Texas, investigators don't follow a standard list of questions presented to the victim after the attack. Some might ask, Did the offender pay particular attention to any item, piece of clothing, or body part? While another might ask this, Did the offender bite any body part? We have varying degrees of interviewing skills. And Deborah Caddy, director of the Women's Center, says police need to adopt uniform standards for rape questioning to catch mobile predators. What we know about sexual predators is that they move around. They move from city to city, they can move from state to state, and we know that. And we know that these predators never strike just one time. This one is my police report. Gabbard says whether it's better questioning or better training for officers, she wants change and is willing to push lawmakers to get it to help remedy mistakes of the past. We do need to, to reach that common ground where everybody's speaking the same language. And Gabbard says that interview right after the rape is so important, not just for catching the offenders, but for prosecution, sex offender treatment, even civil commitment. She's prepared to take her case to the legislature next year.